So I was in the house of the Lord the other day, or as you probably call it, TGI Fridays. The G, of course, stands for God, and the Friday, well that stands for the day in which the Lord God created all the fish that swim in the sea. I found that out on the internet, which is sort of like a Bible of information on things like the Bible. So on the fifth day of biblical creation, God said, Thank me it's Friday. I'm going fishing for the rest of the weekend. To be reminded that he was scheduled to work all day Saturday. At which point, he spent most of the rest of Friday kind of petulantly wandering around going, Starfish? I don't know. Make them star-shaped. Seahorses? Meh. Horse-shaped. Plankton? Whatever. I don't think anyone really cares. And that's how Casual Friday was invented. And at the end of Casual Friday, God went to a casual dining restaurant with an octopus and a couple of dolphins. Well, he doesn't have any co-workers. And that's how TGI Fridays was invented. And I was reminded of this as I took the menu at TGI Fridays and asked my waitress to pray with me. Oh, Heavenly Father, we thank you for your many gifts, particularly the deep-fried appetizer platter for two. For nothing reminds us more of the danger of hellfire and damnation than stuffed jalapeno poppers, both on the way in and on the way out. Oh Lord, please smite the unbelievers who insist on eating at Applebee's, Bennigan's and TAIF. That's thank Allah, it's falafel. If your smiting arm is true, O oh Lord, then smite them with a half rack of baby back ribs. Because those little bits at the end are sharp and you could really take someone's eye out. Plus pork, so irony. And it was as I was being escorted out of TGI Fridays that I came to a sudden realisation that I wanted to share with you today. As a nation, my fellow Americans, we're often looking to religion for answers in what are very troubled times. And that's why I've come here today to talk to you about the franchise opportunity of a lifetime. Picture this, right? Burger King of the Jews. Now, if you're a Catholic, you've gone to Mass and you think you've tasted the body of Christ. But I'm here to tell you that you've never tasted the body of Christ until you've tasted it with two slices of pepper jack cheese and three strips of crispy bacon. If you want lettuce, have lettuce. You want tomatoes, have tomatoes. You want pickles, have pickles. It is, after all, your own personal Jesus. And when you come to Burger King of the Jews, bring the kids. Because if it's your birthday, you get a little cardboard crown of thorns. And every Happy Meal comes with a Passion of the Christ action figure. Don't miss out on this investment opportunity. It's the most immaculately conceived casual dining experience this side of the Last Supper. Operators are standing by. This video has been supplied for parody purposes only. We don't endorse the smiting of infidels with baby back ribs. And in fact, we rather like falafel. And speaking of crass commercialization, coming soon from the people who brought you Beer Tongs brand Beer Tongs, Smiley Intervention brand coffee mugs, just in time for the holidays. Mmm, can you taste the irony?